so I um, am driving around and that's when I do my talking to no one, to you. And what comes to mind today is the change in Dollar Tree pricing, which went from $1 to $1.25. Percentage-wise, $1 versus $1.25 is huge. But to the American consumer, I believe that it's not going to mean that much. So, my hypothesis is that we think we are logical about what we buy, but we are not. And I base this upon the fact that I just went to Dollar Tree for the second time since the price increase. And I'm pretty sure I bought what I would have bought if the prices had been a dollar. So the first time I went to Dollar Tree and saw that many things became a dollar twenty-five, I wasn't sure if everything was a dollar twenty-five or if most things were a dollar twenty-five. But you know, I noticed a week ago or so that lots of things were a dollar twenty-five. And that first time I noticed that, I, I don't remember what I was looking for, but I probably bought it and I left. This time, I thought about it and I bought, I think, what I would have bought regardless. The problem with that line of thinking is you don't know what you would have done if the past had been different, right? And you don't know what you would do if things were the same, because they're not the same. Every day is different. Every situation is different. And maybe I would have done something different. But my hypothesis is that Dollar Tree did not make a mistake that Americans will complain, but they will also support Dollar Tree just as much as they always did, and that Dollar Tree's profits will increase quite a bit because aggregately or, you know, combined, that percentage is really going to help them, and it's going to offset the less products that are sold because people are going to complain but they're going to get used to it and they're going to go on as usual buying whatever they would have bought before at a huge price increase percentage wise without thinking that it's huge so I think and we'll find out that Dollar Tree just made a huge risky move and I believe that it worked in their favor. Stay tuned for further details. No, not further details. Stay tuned for the outcome. Did Dollar Tree make a good decision or will they have to go back on it? Remember when Coke became New Coke and it was a terrible flop? Was it a terrible flop? Because Coke still remains number one. Would that have been different if they had not changed to New Coke? I don't know, but we will be able to tell if Dollar Tree's sales fall flat now or if they stay the same now. And I think they're going to stay the same. So let me know in your comments below what your opinion was when you first heard it was going to happen and what your opinion is now after going to Dollar Tree a couple times. All right, that's it. That's my thought about Dollar Tree today. It is December, and I think that Dollar Tree was filled with all the Christmas crap that it always is, and I think they sold all the Christmas crap that they always sell, and I found some Christmas crap to buy myself. So there we go. Merry Christmas.